The $600 million investment attracted global collaboration from the European Union, USA, China, Japan, and the UK. The plant, constructed under 12 months, created approximately 400 jobs during its first phase, with 90% of workers being Namibian youth. The Oshivela facility is one of the green iron plants committed to zero emissions production. In her inauguration address, President Netumbo Nandindaitwa hailed the project as a testament to Namibia's potential to become a global leader in sustainable industry. She said the plant is a symbol of what visionary leadership and international cooperation can achieve. Initially introduced to the project in 2023 as Deputy Prime Minister, Nandin Daitwa expressed pride in seeing the vision become reality. The president emphasized the project's alignment with national goals of value addition, job creation and industrialization. The plant was constructed by Namibians. They have shown the world that Namibia is prepared to lead, to innovate, and to inspire. It must also be clear to all of us, to all investors, that with the right attitude and good preparation, Namibia is ready to provide the necessary skills. Dr. Nandin Daitwa called for further investment, assuring international partners of a conducive environment. The Minister of Industries, Mines and Energy, Natangwe Ithete, praised the country's bold move towards clean energy. Namibia has taken a bold and forward thinking step by investing in clean technology and developing low to zero carbon industrial model. Our approach focuses on building sustainable industrial cluster that not only reduce emission but also respond to new global trade trends. Where carbon heavy products are increasingly being taxed or restricted. EU Ambassador Anna Beatrice Martens highlighted the EU and German support, which includes new grants worth $255 million to scale up the project. She also announced a $430 billion investment in Namibia's green hydrogen sector. The high ion Oshivela plant is powered by a 44,000 panel solar driven smart microgrid and cutting edge hydrogen technology. The project employs more than 200 locals. <laughs>